Hello everyone, David from goldstartool.com. We are putting a Juki 1560 double needed uh, walking foot machine uh, together right now. Juki uh, LU 1560. Uh, just for you guys to see, made in Japan. A very, very big machine. We're putting the table together. And the, the, as you see, the table, the K legs, the brushless motor, all the hinges are the same as uh, regular and industrial sewing machine. Uh, this machine is semi-dry, meaning that the oil goes inside the machine and you will get only the, the oil, uh, it's not an oil pan, it's the oil drop. Um, Everything is set up the same way as the regular sewing machine. So uh, we're gonna pause and I'm gonna show you how things are uh, gonna be set up. So these are for the corner, cushion for the corner. You put this, goes inside there. And it comes to the corner, right there. And then you get a, all of these things that I'm gonna show you comes with the accessories. Again, this is Juki 1560, double needle walking food machine. You can see, now when you try to move it, you cannot move it. There is a rubber and the pad on top. And you're gonna have four of them for four corners. Here we go, here we go. All four corners, we put the pad on. And we're gonna go do the next step now. So this is actually the hardest part, taking the machine out. It's a really, really heavy sewing machine. I have two people here that are trying to take this out. You gotta make sure the way you take it out, you'll need probably two to three people a really 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 heavy machine see in the box it tells you front or back so you don't have to so that's how big this machine is so this is the front of the machine right here and this is the back let's go ahead be very, very careful when you, you gotta make sure don't chip the corners very slowly. See, like a glove, it goes in there. See, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Double needle, walking food machine, you got the accessories, you got everything here. And serial number made in Japan. I'm gonna go and put the next step as we come back. So we're gonna be doing the knee lifter in the bottom. Okay, can you show it one more time, please? This is the part, sure goes did. in there. Sure you see that's the pin. T pin goes in there and turns. And this is the attachment for the knee, goes in there. Now we have one of the best engineers, sewing machine engineers helping us put the machine together and we're grateful. So the knee lifter, you could actually uh, adjust it to your height, to your mm -hmm. feet, the way you want to sit down and the, knee, the lifter right there goes in there. You tie it. I'm gonna give it. Here you go. And then when you do this, this should happen. And then you could take it out and put it back in there for. I mean, when before we ship it, we don't. I don't think we're gonna put it on. Mm -hmm. So it's very yeah, easy. Yeah. Take, put it in. Mm -hmm. Easily. That's it. Mm -hmm. Right. 
And we're going to do the next step now. Mm-hmm. Okay, next step we're going to put in, this is the, the, the thread tension yeah. right here. And you don't need to screw it, just hammer it very slowly. Yeah, That's yeah. it. That's it. You see the way the holes are this way. The holes are going this way. And it's then we're going to put the belt on. So we already have the belt, number uh-huh. 39. And you see, you could adjust the motor up and down. You see, if you, if you receive the motor here. Yeah. Now we're going to go ahead and tilt it back, put, put it on. And then, you see, it could go up and down. And then from the back. Yeah, you used to hear I went around. Yes. No, I have to stay here. You can. Here's the big screw. This is the biggest screw. You open it up, you tie it, and then you make this. See the way it is? I think quarter inch yes. give. Again, this is Juki 1560. Double needle walking foot. You just tie that one. You see here. Open if you want, adjust more, tie. Okay, this is the belt and this is the belt cover. You might also need to adjust the belt cover if so it won't hit. See if it's holding the belt, you wanna make sure adjust it. There is a screw bottom here and here this is a brushless motor, by the way. Brushless motor with control panel in the front. We're gonna come back to you and we're gonna do the next step.